Hey guys, Brian from Pancan Overland here, just giving you a quick update on the last week. Um, so, uh, let's see, what all has happened? Um, I don't know if you saw in my Instagram post that uh, I was going into the hospital for a much needed surgery. Um, I got my port reinstalled and it has been working flawlessly. Um, I had chemo last week and this week has been an off week for chemo. Um, let's see, what else has happened? Oh, um, my pain has increased um, quite a bit. So one of the things that I did in the past when I had really, really bad pain was get a thing called the a celiac plexus block and um, that procedure is uh, basically it's a surgery it's a outpatient surgery um, they numb an area in your in your chest or your stomach area um, insert a needle into that uh, with a for lack of a better description, a an alcohol solution. And that alcohol solution um, is designed to, um, to take out nerves, uh, nerve endings. So um, the alcohol solution gets uh, injected in, the uh, nerves then die, um, and you don't experience pain. Um, it lasts for about six months. In, in, in my case, it has lasted for about six months in the past. Uh, this is the third time that I've had that, and uh, it is amazing uh, to not feel as much pain as, uh, as I normally do. So, um, that went really well. I am healing up a little bit from that. Um, there are obvious side effects that are caused as a result of it. Um, some increased pain where they uh, inject the, um, the alcohol solution. They actually go into your, your chest area here with a needle and I didn't see how long the needle is but it's I'm assuming it's long. I just honestly didn't want to look. I don't like needles. Um, but anyway, um, so I have a little discomfort right there. Um, that should subside um, shortly, and then I'll be back to normal, whatever the new normal is. So anyway, so that's that's the update there. That was on Wednesday, and... Um, yeah, the last two days I have felt less pain and a little bit better every single day. So that's been fantastic. Um, what's next? What's coming? Um, I have chemo again next week on Monday. Uh, it's really good to be back on a schedule again. Uh, I feel like uh, that seven weeks, six or seven weeks that I was off from chemo, um, I just didn't feel like I was fighting, and uh, being back on a schedule is uh, is fantastic. I I feel like I'm I'm attacking it again. I'm attacking the pancreatic cancer again, and uh, the full fox um, from uh, the week before uh, didn't go so uh, so bad. It um, it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be. So. Um, not as many side effects as I expected, and uh, just generally better than I expected. So, um, that is the latest there. So, um, I uh, don't know if I've ever told anybody, but um, I am a photographer, part-time photographer. I've had my own business for a number of years, and one of the things that uh, I have done in the past and something that I had to um, stop doing for a little while uh, is a thing called the ballet project. Um, just a quick little uh, thing about that. It's uh, basically it's um, uh, dancers, ballerinas um, in uh, street photography. It's uh, urban photography. Um, 
and I am rekindling that project. I'm I'm getting back um, back to doing that again, and uh, and it feels good. It um, it feels good to get back to doing some of the things that I love. Um, overlanding is is one of those things. Travel is absolutely something that I love, but I also love photography. And I love working with um, the amazing dancers that I have worked with, um, from professional to amateur, from um, four, 13, 14 years old, all the way up to uh, dancers in their 20s. It's been a blast. Um, there's, um, it's, uh, it's just uh, a ton of support from the dance community um, um, for me through all of this and I can't thank the dance community enough for uh, sticking with me, um, lifting me up and um, and uh, helping me uh, with words of encouragement and support and, and donations and, and just all sorts of great things from the dance com um, community. Um, companies, uh, dancers, individual dancers, and dancer moms and dads, thank you so much for your support and thank you for uh, for helping out with that, um, or for helping me get through all of this. So uh, I am resuming that. So that's uh, I just made a post on my Instagram account for theballetproject.com. It's a link down there in the description and um if you like dance photography go ahead and uh, follow me over there but um anyway so that's uh that's the latest update um we'll see what's happening this weekend and um and uh, i'll maybe fill you in on something else a little bit later on or something um but thank you all so much for following me uh for checking in I know I've been a little bit quiet lately, um, so to those of you who have checked in, thank you so much, Dan. Um, everybody else, my gosh, uh, it, your support is just um, priceless. Thank you so much. Um, like, share, and um, if you know anyone who is going through pancreatic cancer and they want to talk to someone, have them get in touch. I'd love to talk to them. Um, it's a crappy club to be in, but um, us warriors, our, us survivors, us fighters uh, need to stick together and help each other. So, um, thanks so much for following. Thanks for uh, liking, subscribing, and sharing. And uh, we will see you again very, very soon. Have a great weekend. Bye.